Hello, this is Materi. Um, this is the ninth video in my sound design tutorial series. And in this video, we're going to be going over pads, I hope. Pads are very difficult, but they're very simple at the same time. It's hard to explain. It's just um, not a lot of people know how to make pads, so you got to go about it kind of doing your own thing and it almost seems random but hopefully this tutorial will help you make some sweet pads <clears throat> so if we're in massive we could just do new sound as usual and if you think about pads they're just chords and they have a long attack and a long release so instantly or right away we could do a long attack and a long release. And just with uh, a saw wave, we got that. Now if you think about our pluck that we just did, which was a saw square and then whatever we could do the same thing and we can get a cool um a cool um pad sound we do four put the pan up shelf down and the high shelf up. We could even put it through a low pass. And we could add reverb to this and a dimension expander. pass is dulling down the sound and making it kind of um, more dark sounding as opposed to being bright when we turn the cutoff up. Let's see if this works real quick. Nope. Um No, of course. We want it on poly uh polyphonic, of course. So yeah, I'm just trying to think about something real quick. <clears throat> Let me play around. Well, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, you can play around and really get something. 
But pads usually have a long attack and a long release. Let's say, put that on there and put this on our cutoff instead. Really, that's all you really need to know. But um, about pads, it's just long attack, long release, a lot of reverb, maybe some uh, pitch cut off. Uh, let's see what else we could do. I'm not really good at making pads, so I'm not the best to be explaining this. But that's like a general idea. I guess that's all I'll go over because I don't want to keep like spewing random information about pads when I'm not the best at making pads myself. Shit. But that's really all you should know about pads. So thanks for watching. Uh, the next videos are going to be about base design. So you can stick and stick around, watch that, watch the next tutorials. If you didn't already watch the last, uh, tutorials this entire series is supposed to help you guys make your own sounds so i hope you guys are um following along and understanding and commenting if you don't understand something and i'll respond back so thanks for watching like comment subscribe watch the next videos and goodbye